So there were quite a lot of messages that I received overnight and that we received about um, making some clarifications to some points that I made yesterday at the press conference. So I think it's important just to, just to if I can briefly cover some of the perhaps some of the misunderstandings um, from what I said yesterday. So I think what's important related to transmission is what we know, uh, importantly, what we don't know, and what we're trying to do to really understand this very complex uh, question. There are some estimates um, that suggest that um, anywhere between 6% of the population and 41% of the population may be infected but not have uh, symptoms within a, a point estimate of around 16%. I don't want to get too technical, um, but that we do know that some people who are asymptomatic or some people who don't have symptoms can transmit the virus on. And so what I was referring to yesterday in the press conference were a very few studies, some two or three studies that have been published that actually try to follow asymptomatic cases, so people who are infected over time and then look at all of their contacts and see how many additional people were infected. And that's a very small subset of studies. Um, and in that, I use the phrase very rare. And I think that that's um, misunderstanding to, to state that, that asymptomatic transmission globally is very rare. What I was referring to was a subset of, of, of studies. 